In this video demonstration, we're going to configure the Cisco Security Management Appliance for delegated administration of the Cisco Web Security Appliance. Many enterprises want to use one security management appliance to manage multiple web security appliance deployments where access policies can vary by geographic location. For example, they want a customized set of rules for employees in EMEA and a separate set of customized rules for employees in the USA where these rules are managed locally. This video shows how to configure the SMA to accomplish that. After authenticating to the security management appliance, it is necessary that the web security appliances be configured. From the centralized services, go to security appliances and add each web appliance separately, selecting configuration management as well as reporting and establish your connection. Next, we will configure our delegated administration we will move to system administration user roles and create a separate web role for each administration. EMEA, visible or hidden, push privileges on or off. Can they push changes to the web security appliances? We will add our USA. Next, we will assign users to those roles. We will add a user. Select custom roles that we just created and assign a password. Add the user for USA admin. Select the appropriate role and assign a password. Then we will return back to our roles and verify that the users have been assigned. Next, we will go into our web security configuration. Selecting identities, we will create an identity for each country deployment. Notice we have now the option to include certain appliances. In this configuration, I'm going to change to manually select and select the EMEA appliance for the EMEA identity. I'm going to identify my users by subnet. Create my identity for the USA. Selecting the appropriate appliance. Now that I have my identities created, I will create access policies and tie those to these newly created identities. First, I'll add my policy for EMEA. Select my identity. Next, I'll add my USA. Select the identity for the USA.
Now I have the ability to customize URL filtering, application visibility, malware settings, as well as view policies by the appliance. By viewing only the USA, I focus that administrator on the ability there. By viewing only EMEA, likewise. Here we have configured the SMA to provide delegated administration with separation of duties. By using the user roles, then we need to assign the configuration for EMEA to the EMEA role. Come in, select the EMEA, which would then allow them to customize the access policies. And the USA, same. At this point, it is necessary to commit your changes. And in order for those changes to be deployed, they must be published to the web security appliances. This concludes this video demonstration.